Did we just get onto the main road? Uh-huh. Waze has done it again. Alright, are we good to go? Uh, yeah, we should be good to go. Perfect. My name is Ryan, and I recently sold my bed frame for $140. This is the story of me losing that $140 in Vegas. There are really only two rules in life. And as much as I hate to say it, one of them is never turn down Vegas. We are headed from Sacramento to Carson City to Vegas. What could go wrong? Donner Pass closed. Road to Carson City doesn't look good. Literally off-roading. The road's spooky. Where are we? It, this is a ways road. Every road in this whole state of California seems to be closed right now. We are on some mystical road sort of thing. Bad news, 395 closed to 208. You're going to have to come all the way up to Carson City to get to Yarrington. You can't go through shortcut. Middle finger emoji, poop emoji. We're not ready for this. I get it. You guys have probably been asking, why do they need to go to Reno? Well, our friend Bubs, this guy, has to be reunited with his girlfriend Grace, this girl who's in Vegas. Or else. Or else. So Bubs, Bubs' dad said, don't worry about him, I will get him to Vegas. Okay. So Bubs is going to Vegas. We are saying F it and we're heading, we're heading straight to Vegas through Fresno. I think if we do that, oh this is going to fall. It's not stable. We need a counterweight. Oh gosh, the counterweight's not working. After 13 mind-numbing hours in the car, we finally make it to Vegas, the city where dreams go to die. There's an outrageous amount of smells in this city. None of, none of them are, are really good. I lost it all. There's a saying in Vegas. The house always wins, but tonight we were all winners, except this guy. Only just lost two hundred bucks, but I learned a lot. Two hundred bucks might not seem like a lot of money to someone rich like you, but to me, it was sixty more dollars than I'd had that morning, and two hundred dollars more than I'd had that night. At least we got fireworks.